today I'm going to tell you a story. The story name is The Ox Who Learns a Lesson. So let's begin the story. Once there was a farm. In the farm there was an ox. He had three brothers who used to carry heavy loads of hay. They worked every day, helped one another. One would entertain after a long day and the other would help the other when the person was sick. They, his three brothers were all kind and gentle to each other. But Dan was very different. He was lazy and fat. He had grown very fat because his, he had been too lazy. His tummy came up and his back was all chubby. And one day, Dan heard the farmer saying to his wife, Dan is too lazy. He doesn't do anything. I have to sell him. And Dan was very angry when he heard this. He decided that he would do something to impress the farmer so he would not get sold. So, Dan said to all the animals in the farm that whoever would win the race scheduled next month would get all of his pocket money. And that race was scheduled for the other month that was coming by. Dan worked very hard to, to win the race and impress the farmer. He started working hard and soon he grew muscles and, and he was not lazy, lazy anymore. And on the day of the race, Dan joined the race. Everybody was shocked because they thought that Dan was too chubby and he couldn't participate. He just wanted to hold a contest. They thought that. The farmer said, ready, steady, go. Everybody ran, ran, and Dan was initially left behind, but he ran, and he soon overtook the sheep. Then he overtook the cow, and the and the and the chicken, and after that he overtook the horse and won the race. The farmer was very impressed and praised Dan for his hard work. Dan kept, got to keep all his pocket money, but he still used his pocket money to distribute sweets in the farm. From that day on, Dan never remained lazy again. The moral of the story is we should never be lazy. Laziness can always cause to us having in bad failures. So if you like the story, like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell icon for my latest videos. Thank you and until next time.